Hi, Book Cougars. It's Russell from Ink and Paper Blog. Thank you so much for inviting me to part, be part of your celebration of National Poetry Month. Um, I'm super excited to read to you one of my favorite poems that I have ever read in my life. Now, I first read this poem uh, back in my freshman year of college, and it has, and its imagery has, stuck with me for my entire adult reading life. Um, it is a dark poem, but also starkly beautiful, and I hope you guys like it. So, here we go with Not Waving But Drowning by Stevie Smith. Nobody heard him, the dead man, but still he lay moaning. I was much further out than you thought, not waving, but drowning. Poor chap, he always loved larking, and now he's dead. It must have been too cold for him. His heart gave way, they said. Oh, no, 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 it was too cold always. Still the dead one lay moaning. I was much too far out all of my life, and not waving, but drowning. So that's Not Waving But Drowning by Stevie Smith. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you again so much for inviting me to be part of your celebration of National Poetry Month. And until next time, guys, I'll see you soon. Bye.